workers' rights, fighting for fair taxation, fighting for the 99%. I give you the leader and the next Premier of Ontario, Andrew Horak.
people and actually bargain. As you know, in the last election I ran to be Premier of this province. And at that time I said, I said before the election, and I'm going to say it again, we might not always agree on everything, but we can always, always sit across the table at the bargaining table and find a solution. I will always respect the work that you do. And I can go one further. I can promise you that I'm not going to send somebody out to a press conference to attack you, and I'm not going to go into my office, shut the curtains, lock the doors, and tape a YouTube video about you. <laughs> now, I've traveled across this province for many, many months now for years. And I can tell you that I've met people from all walks of life, from all kinds of workplaces, from all kinds of backgrounds, and Ontario workers are the best workers in the entire world. You're dedicated, you're productive, you're smart, you're flexible, and you make this province work every single day. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. I hope that there is not an election next week, but when it does come, people will definitely have a choice, and it will be a clear choice. Do we want more corporate tax giveaways that cost billions and billions of dollars? Or do we want smart investments that create jobs and prosperity in this Ontario market? Do we want to start closing daycares? Or do we want the same old antagonism that has failed time and time again? Now, I firmly believe and my team believes that Ontario will only prosper if Ontarians are prospering. Ontario will only do well if Ontario's people are doing well. That's the future that New Democrats believe in. I believe that that's the future that you all believe in. And I am looking forward to making it a reality with all of you and everybody else in this province. Thank you very much.